They're off in the EP Teller Stakes. Silly Hill broke sharply from that inside stall, and now Folk Gopper is sent to the front by Frankie Dettori. And it's Folk Gopper to set the early pace. Green Lions comes on on the outside in a second position. Sealy Hill will save ground to the back stretch, and to her outside is uh, Toke Decada as they take that hairpin into the back stretch. And it's Folk Opera being coddled on a lead of a length and a half. Green Lions is in a second position at opening quarter in 26 and 2. Folk Opera in a comfortable lead. Green Lions shadows. Folk Gopper in second. Toke Decada down to the inside. Third and Callwood Dancer is fourth. Sealy Hills back in fifth and four and a half lengths off the lead. Then we have Royal Pleasure and Hostess. Jay Ray's in hand to Joe Bravo and Classy Landlady is the trailer. The Tory and Folk Opera through a 51 and 2 additional half mile. And it's Folk Opera by three quarters of a length. Watched intently by Green Lions in second. Toke Decada bottled up inside. She appears to have some run. Callwood Dancer is to the outside in fourth position. Then Sealy Hill in fifth. Royal Pleasure is in sixth. Jay Ray starts to winch up at the rail from seventh. Then Hostess and a classy landlady. Three quarters, one sixteen and three. Folk Opera trying to go it all the way on the front end. Has been shadowed throughout by Green Lions. Toke Decada waiting for a scene. Callwood Dancer was on the outside. Royal Pleasure is getting closer on the far outside. And they turn into the lane to the roar of the crowd. And the Tory sets down Folk Opera. On the outside, Green Lions. Callwood Dancer is on the far outside. Folk Opera still the one to catch. They're in the final eighth of a mile. Folk Opera by two. Callwood Dancer. Sealy Hill is on the far outside. Folk Opera went to the front and made every pull a winning one. Folk Opera scores a smashing victory in the E.P. Teller Stakes over Colwood Dancer and Sealy Hill. Jay Ray was fourth.